Hey guys, welcome back to Crystal Bricks. Today I'm going to be reviewing a LEGO extra set. This is the LEGO Brick Stickers. And today I'm going to be going over it, showing what's included in the set, and talking about it. So I know I usually don't post on Wednesdays, but this video is going to be part of a new series, which is going to be called Review Wednesdays, where every Wednesday I'll be putting out a review of a set that I have really enjoyed, or have maybe not enjoyed. To start off with the set, I really like the packaging that they use for this. You didn't have to cut anything, and it wasn't the thumb tabs at, at the bottom of the boxes. This you just have to peel off the side, and then you get access to two different sections, which are put off to the side. One in the front is the stickers, and then on the back it's the bricks that you can use, which are mostly extra pieces, but some are little builds. So, just as I open it, I already see the first problem, which is that the stickers are already peeling. <laughs> this is really bad, because they might lose their stickiness, and some of them are already like halfway off. I don't know if you can see it in this shot, but it's really bad. And I'm surprised that this is even happening. So now that I've opened it up and took out all the contents, as you can see, it comes with five different sticker packets. These are all different stickers, which I find mostly use, which will mostly be good for LEGO City. And then on the back, it does come with a small advertisement for other LEGO City and extra sets. So now that we have seen all the stickers, I'm going to go into the pieces that are included with the set. So to start off, it comes with a very useful sign that can go sideways on any building. This I feel like would be useful for modulars. And another piece that I found that was really useful that was included was a large glass piece. And then after that, I decided to build the sign. So I built the sign and then I decided to use a sports sticker. It wasn't coming in too clearly, so I apologize if you can't really see it. And then I'm going to try and test it out to see how it looks in the LEGO City. So as you can see in the shot, it does work really well in the city. And I'm super happy how the stickers turned out, even though they were peeling a, a lot. So that's all for today's video. I hope to see you in the next Reviews Wednesday. And thanks for watching.